Hello everybody, I'm El Pengare and welcome to another Skyrim tutorial. In this tutorial I'm going to show you three different methods on how to retexture Skyrim. The first method is basically if you set up your image editing program such as Photoshop or GIMP or any others that may come out is we simply overwrite one of the existing files. For example, bread01.dds. If I went into Photoshop and I messed with that file and then I saved saved the file and then dragged it back and overwrit the file, then yes, I would have retextured bread. The second method is we go into NIFScope. I've opened up bread in NIFScope. I'm going to click on it. I'm going to click on Nitri Shape. I'm going to go to the BS Lighting Shader property and go to BS Texture Shape. So I'm going to choose the first uh, purple flower here. Bread Texture Tint. Double click that. And I'm going to select a random texture. Let me give it a candy. And now I've retextured it into candy. I can also retexture the normal map. It's pretty much the same thing. Candy. Candy one and this. And now with the normal map, everything, the light behaves differently and the, the bump map is differently. There. So that is how we uh, can retexture objects within Skyrim with NIFScope. And the third way is if we go into the creation kit itself. If we go to the object window and we go to miscellaneous, we'll find something called a texture set. If we click on that, we've got all the texture sets that's available for us to use. We've got stuff for clothes, we've got stuff for landscape, lots of good stuff here. What we can do is right click on the editor ID and go to new and now we can select our new texture. So let's find a DDS map and it will be candy.dds and there it will load up our texture file pretty cool. Let's give it a name. AA New Bread Candy. You can also give it a normal map by clicking on the normal map here and then we go selected image and you can find the candy normal map then we're right there so therefore we got both a diffuse map and a normal map brilliant press OK and there it is AA new bread candy now the next step if we want to retexture stuff in creation kit we're using this method is we have to find uh, the object that we want to retexture Let's just give it food bread zero one C C for candy. Just for let's just name it to candy bread. And what we really want to do is to go to model here, right here, where it says clutter slash food slash bread zero one a dot now I have. Go to edit. This brings up a 3D model. And we're gonna go to alternative textures click on with the 3d name here double click and now we can scroll down to AA new bread candy what we created once again since we called it AA it's easier to find press OK and voila we have candy bread it doesn't look appetizing with that burnt bottom does it press OK yes we want to create a new form and if we view the preview window
and preview it we have retextured our object pretty cool those are three ways you can retext your objects in for and modern i hope this tutorial has helped you and if it has please share with others on social media so we can all help each other out thank you